Good afternoon. Welcome to Deep Thoughts While Driving. Me, myself, and I here as per the norm. It is Sunday, which makes it my Friday. I got an interesting couple of text messages and then phone call. Long story short, the grandparents and great-grandparents are kidnapping my son. <laughs> uh, but, no, seriously. Um, so, there's some stuff going on. I'm not going to get into details because it's family business and, well, none of yours. Anyhow, so my wife, when she got off work the other day on shoulder, Saturday, uh, well, she got off work on Friday. She made plans with dad, her dad. Anyhow, so she, uh, Green light today, sometime soon. Look at car. Squirrel! Distracted. Anyhow, my wife. So, yes, um, Saturday my wife got picked up by her father, and then, well, my, my wife went out to her grandparents' place. Her and my son both got picked up by her father, and they went to Mackenzie for the weekend. So, yay them. Um, So my mother-in-law is in the hospital for medical reasons, obviously with the hospital. So my father-in-law, dad, he's uh, home alone. He doesn't do home alone well. He's been home alone for a while. So that's why my wife and my son went to went home with him to Mackenzie to keep him company and you know help him feel better. Um, so the plan was they were both going to come back on Monday. Oh. Sunday, possibly Monday. So then the plans changed. And they're going to come back on Monday. And then the plans changed again. <laughs> My wife is coming home on Monday. What's happening is I'm going to meet them at Fair Lake, which is halfway. Um, I got to pick up a couple things that need to be going back to Mackenzie for mom and a bag of clothes for my son because apparently the five pairs of jeans that I put in his bag weren't quite enough. He needed more. I don't know what he's doing, but okay. He's been there for two days. Day and a half. Day and a half. <laughs> I, I don't want to know. So, okay, whatever. Anyhow, uh, <laughs> so the plan now is I'm going to meet them in Bear Lake. I'm going to spend five minutes with my son and give him a great big hug and kiss and give him the bag of clothes that he needs. And then dad's going to take him back to Mackenzie and then I will bring my wife home. The couple of groceries I got to um, grab, I will grab anyhow. So, yeah. And then, um, so I, just, I still got to go to work. I'm on my way to work right now. I work before the midnight. Then I get home, basically try and go to sleep. Not long after I get home. So I can get a decent night's sleep so I can wake up early to an alarm which never bodes well for me um, go to save on get the groceries get out to Bear Lake for which is about 45 minutes to an hour drive ish um, spend five minutes with my son then drive my wife back here to town and my son is staying in Mackenzie because the brother-in-law and sister-in-law and the, their kids are going to be out there on Tuesday to Mackenzie on Tuesday. Get a little mini family reunion. The wife will be here working. I'll be here working. Well, I got my three days off, but regardless. Then Thursday, to my understanding, um, he's coming back to Prince George, but he's going to the great-grandparents' place. Or no, he's not coming to Prince George. He's going to Whiskers. Um, where the great grandparents are going to take him and they're going to go to Whiskers and they'll keep him at the lake for the long, for the August long weekend. So I'm not going to see my son until Monday the 3rd and it's Sunday the 26th right now. Yeah, the grandparents and great grandparents are kidnapping my kid. So fun. I was also informed by my wife 
that she has Saturday and Sunday off. So either Friday after she gets off work, because she gets off work at five, she might go to the lake and see the great grand, well, see her grandparents, my son's great grandparents, and see her son, which means I'll be home alone again. But she'd only go out there for the evening and then she'd come home. Right, because grandpa will convince her to stay for dinner. Then it's late, so she should have a drink. And then now she's had a drink, she can't go, so now she has to stay the night. I know how this works. Unless she waits until Saturday, and then she can go out. Um, if need be, we could go out for like the afternoon. I'd have to come home in time to go to work. So I probably won't go out at all, because yeah, I'm driving basically two hours there, hanging up for an hour or two, and then two hours back. So I could be here to go to work. So plans have been changing a lot lately. So yeah, I'm not going to see my son for the next eight or nine days. So it'll be about 12 days that it will be since I've seen my son, with the exception of maybe seeing him for five minutes tomorrow. Yeah. Alrighty. This should be entertaining. At least for my son. Probably not for me, but at least for my son. So, yeah. That is the grandparents, because it's her dad, father in law, which makes it my son's grandpa. And the great grandparents, so grand. Dad's going to have our son till Thursday. And then the great, then the grandparents, my son's great grandparents, will have him Thursday to Monday at the lake. Why does everybody get to have fun and I don't? I gotta work. It sucks. Anyhow, yeah. So basically, that's it. So yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. <sighs> so yep. Um. That's it. Any more, we'll just be whining and complaining. So that's it. That's all. Take care easy. Have a good one. Stay home. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Catch you later.